any number that's not a prime number can be written as prime numbers multiplied together. Here's a question that says express 120 as the product of its prime factors. That means rewrite 120 as prime numbers multiplied together. And to do this, we're going to start with 120. And we're going to break it down by looking at what numbers multiply to make 120. So we need to start with two numbers that multiply to make 120. It doesn't matter which two we pick. So I'm going to pick 2 and 60. 2 times 60 makes 120. And 2 is a prime number. So I can't break 2 down anymore. But I can break 60 down. So 60 is again in the 2 times table. And it's 2 times 30. So 2 is a prime number. I can't break it down anymore. I can break 30 down more. 30 is again in the 2 times table. And it's 2 times 15. Can I break 15 down more? What numbers multiply to make 15? 3 times 5. So 3 is prime. You can't break 3 down anymore. 5 is also prime. I can't break 5 down anymore. So I've broken 120 down until I've just got prime numbers left. So I can say 120 can be written as 2 times 2 times 2 times 3 times 5. So 2 times 2 times 2 times 3 times 5. And if we multiply those numbers together, we should get back to 120. So this is 120 written as a product of its prime factors. And we can check this by going back up the tree. So 5 times 3 is 15. 15 times 2 is 30. 30 times 2 is 60. And 60 times 2 is 120. We can also write this in a different way. Because we've got 2 times 2 times 2. We can change that to 2 cubed. So I can have 2 cubed times 3 times 5. We don't have to do that. Either one of these are correct. Okay, so here's a question for you to try. So express 132 as the product of its prime factors. So we'll start with 132. It's in the 2 times table, so I'll write 2 times, and 2 times what is 132? That's 66. 2 is prime, and 66 isn't, it can be broken down again. So 66 is 2 times 33. And 33 can be broken down again. It's in the 3 times table, and it's 3 times 11. And both of those are prime numbers. So 132 can be written as 2 times 2 times 3 times 11, or we could write that as 2 squared times 3 times 11. Okay, three more questions here. Pause the video, give them a go, and press play when you're ready to go through the answers. Question one, we got 90. So 90 is 2 times 45. 45 is 3 times 15. And 15 is 3 times 5. So 90 is 2 times 3 times 3 times 5. 
or 2 times 3 squared times 5. 330 for question 2. So it's in the 2 times table. It's 2 times 165. 165 is in the 3 times table. And it's 3 times 55. And 55 is in the 5 times table. 5 times 11. So 330 is 2 times 3 times 5 times 11. And finally, 420. So that's 2 times 210, which is 2 times 105, which is 3 times 35, which is 5 times 7. So we've got 2 times 2 times 3 times 5 times 7 or 2 squared times 3 times 5 times 7.